Now, Sean Robinson, I was wondering if you were, were ever so cold that you really started to get worried about how cold you were because it'd be kind of risky, dangerous in some respect to worry about it. That's good. Uh -huh. You know when you have something you actually want to tell, and then you kind of like, oh, now I have to fit it into what it said. <laughs> when I was in the military, I was a Navy diver, as well as a nuclear power guy. Every, every submarine had to have three Navy divers to, when you're in a foreign port and you go on the outside and do a security swim every morning to see if anyone put bombs on the ship <coughs> during the night before. It's a bad thing to have a bomb on a nuclear ship for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> well, one day, our ship goes into something called dry dock. This is in Kittery, Maine. Before it went into dry dock, someone needed to go over the side, and I believe I needed to unscrew some hafnium bolts or the plates from the, from the ship. So I get into a dry suit, which means that no water actually touches your body, but we had to put about an inch of Vaseline on my face as I went in. So I went in over the side, and I did what I needed to do, and I got up, and the wind came through, and my black dry suit turned white. But I wasn't afraid, because nothing actually touched my body. However, if you are in really cold water with a really nice wetsuit, and you do this, then there's a little pocket that starts right here, and all that cold water rushes under your armpit. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> or if you do this, 